thank you, Lord. This is a portion of service that we all can participate in. Hallelujah. The Bible talks about how he loves a cheerful giver. Hallelujah. And we know that we're sown on good ground and it shall produce good fruit. Hallelujah. Just look at your neighbor and say, neighbor, neighbor. I'm sown on good ground. I'm sown on good ground. And I know I will. I know I will. Produce the fruit. Without tithing and offering held up high, Father, in the name of Jesus, we thank you. We thank you, Lord God, just for another opportunity to sow into your kingdom. And Lord God, we came with a smile on our faces, Lord God, and expecting you to do something, Lord God. You already know what we're in need of. Before we even ask, so Lord, we said thank you. We thank you for um, destroying yokes. We thank you for lifting heavy burdens. We thank you, Lord God, for just, just being who you are, Lord God. You're a God that heals. You're a God that delivers. You're a God that set captives free. And Lord God, we know that with the seed of faith, Lord God, that we're sowing on good ground. And it shall produce good fruit, Lord God. That 30, that 60, that 100 fold. And again, Lord God, we come to you thanking you, Lord God, for this day, Lord God. And we came to celebrate your name. We celebrate your birth. We came to celebrate who you are, Lord God. You are El Shaddai. You are Elohim. Hallelujah. We just thank you, Lord God, for just being everything. Everything, Lord God. Everything that we can think of or need, Lord God. Your hands have truly provided. In Jesus' mighty name, we pray and give thanks. Amen. 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 Hallelujah. And please don't forget about the Cash App. You can download um, our church app. And um, you can see many ways to give. In Jesus' name, we pray. Praise the Lord. We thank God for this beautiful young girl. In the name of the Lord. Amen. With Miss Johnson, I start trying to pronounce these first names, I'm going to be in trouble. All right. And we thank God for Brother Johnson, Sister Gilbert, praise the Lord. Thank God for the God parents. Amen. This is Mr. Johnson uh, Thompson. God bless you. You know, the Bible says in, in 1 Samuel chapter 1 with Hannah. She was praying for a child. And she made a vow to the Lord. If you bless me, I'll give this child back to you. And so here is a moment where you're saying we're going to dedicate our child back to God. That's taking responsibility that we will raise her in the fear of God. That she will know God. She'll know about God until she comes to the consciousness of who God is for herself. And so you are committing and you're vowing before the Lord today that this beautiful young girl that God has blessed you with will be raised and taught in the fear of the Lord. The Bible says raise up a child in the way it should go and when it get over and not depart. What that saying is not our ways, but you have to know what God wants for her. So you have to pray and ask God, how do we teach her? What should we direct her? We don't know whether she's going to be a heart surgeon we don't know what she's going to be. But God already knows that. Amen. It's up to us to be sure that we teach her about the things of God. What we will do is anoint her and pray over her. And when we, when we pray over her, we pass her to the godparents. Okay? Because they're committed to help you raise her. If you don't uh, take responsibility, they have the job of challenging you all, of taking that responsibility. That's what this is about. 
dedicated her back to the fear of the Lord because Hannah gave Samuel over to Eli, the high priest, and you are acting as Eli to her to be sure that these parents, this beautiful young lady, is raised in the fear of God. That she shall know her in the name of the Lord. Let us pray. Turn God our Father in the name of Jesus the Christ. We thank you. We thank you for this young lady, little Miss Johnson. We thank you for her. We ask your anointing on her life, and I pray for her parents. I pray that you give them the wisdom and the understanding and the knowledge, God, how to direct her path. That when she comes to the consciousness of who you are, that she'll give you the glory, and she'll know who you are in the name of Jesus. And I pray for the God parents. That God, that you give them the things that they need. And I pray, God, that there, this, in these houses there be no lack. Amen. That they have provision they have to be in the name of Jesus the Christ. We thank you. We dedicate her back to you. In Jesus' name. Amen. Would you pass her to the God parents? God bless you all. All right. Can you all stand still? Can you come take a picture back right here? Go ahead.
Tonight, as tonight, I look up in the stars in the sky and remember another star from days long gone by that shone oh so brightly to show me the way to a small baby lay in a manger of hay. This baby was sweet, all shiny and new, but he means so much more to me and you. We know him as Jesus Christ or Emmanuel, and his story is one we have long loved to tell because it is the story of the best of men of mercy and sacrifice and. God's all in one plan. It's his story of love beyond measure of a father who gave, his, who gave us his most precious treasure. I think of all of this as I look at the stars. I think about the love of God and I close my eyes and cross myself and I pray that I will remember this love every day.
worship team. We thank God for the choir. Praise the Lord. Wasn't that awesome? Oh, come on, give God some glory. Amen. That, what's the name of that song she said? was real simple, and y'all said, okay. Man, I tell you what. <laughs> y'all were hitting those like, oh, my goodness. Oh, I'm so full. I'm so full. I tell you, I thank the Lord for His goodness and His mercy. You know, the Bible teaches us, unto us a child is born, unto us a son is given. God gave his only begotten son, that whosoever believeth in him should not perish, but have an everlasting life. When Jesus was born, the angels rejoiced. Praise the Lord. Growing to God in the eyes. The shepherds came to worship him. Praise the Lord. But now he puts back, he sends back his Holy Spirit into our hearts. And through the his spirit being his filling our hearts with his presence, we can say glory to God in the eyes. We can take a moment and just, just lift our hands to the Lord and just worship Him. Amen. For being in our hearts. Just worshiping the Lord for His goodness and His mercy. Hallelujah. We praise the Lord. We thank the Lord. Hallelujah. Glory to God. God, we thank you. We pray for those who are listening to us live. We pray, God, that you will touch them. You will heal them. You will deliver them. You will bless them. That God can have no lack in this season. Because you promised you supply all of our needs according to your riches and glory. And God, those who are shut in and can't get out, I know you can touch them right now with your love. And God, that those, God, in the name of lost loved ones during this time, I know you can comfort them. Because God, you are our comforter. In the name of Jesus the Christ, we praise you, we bless you, we honor you. We thank you today. For your goodness and your mercy. In Jesus' name. Amen. amen. Listen, on this week, I think Christmas is Saturday. Christmas Eve is Friday. Praise the name of the Lord. I want you to enjoy this week. In the name of the Lord, if we'll, if we'll be on air on Wednesday, we'll let you know. But uh, we have, we'll have service next Sunday morning. In the name of the Lord. But we do have some gifts we want to give out. Praise the name of the Lord. And some thanks for our seniors. In the name of the Lord, and some thanks for um, others. In the name of the Lord. So, Sister Carissa, are you ready? Sister Tracy, in the name of the Lord. Trustee, we all, Deacon, we all have Sister Tracy, praise the name of the Lord. And we want to be a blessing to our seniors, be a blessing to uh, those who God is placing our hearts. To families in the name of the Lord and give us a name in Jesus' name. We well, thank God for the first do I praise the name of the Lord. Amen. Praise the Lord. Just bear with us for a few moments. In the name of the Lord. Amen. I tell you, the presence of the Lord is here. Amen. The presence of the Lord is just in our hearts. Thank God for our visitors. Praise the name of the Lord. Bless you. some gift cards in there also.
Did we get all our cities? On the clock, did you get yours? Deacon Larry, Mother Jones, and Deacon Jones. He take that. And we're praying much for Deacon Jones' his home. He's getting better, but they're very particular about who comes by. Okay. Yeah. Anyone else? Do we, who else we miss? Oh, Deacon Kendall. They went to Pennsylvania to pick up the grandson.